This is the squad. Pant, 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 pant. I got bribes in the land. Just a dolly in the fan. Credit cards in the scams. Hitting the licks in the van. How you doing today guys my name is Luke aka Pokeballer Luke and welcome to a call commentary I kind of wanted to upload something different so I figured I'd do one of these now anyways lately I've been just chillaxing as you guys have seen my uploads have been a little bit scarce hey what's up guys it's scarce here and I feel kind of bad for that I've just been going through some stuff I guess there's really no excuse but yeah Anyways, last week, I was sitting in the living room with my brother, and I saw that he was playing some Pokemon Leaf Green, and it honestly got me thinking. I haven't really played a Pokemon game in the longest time. Now, I don't mean, like, shiny hunting or just doing something random, like a battle. I just mean playing the actual Pokemon game. And it got me thinking, I decided to finally play my Heart Gold copy. This is the same one that I got the shiny Totodile on it. Y yeah, y th this shiny Totodile. What? Oh my gosh! Anyways, I finally managed to beat the Elite Four, and that's what you're seeing in the background of this video. But yeah, Heart Gold is super fun. It honestly might be the best Pokemon game of all time. I don't know, I really like it because you relive the old adventure of gold with updated graphics and some new Pokemon. Like, look, two of my team members are Gen 4 Pokemon, being Ambipom and Mamoswine. But yeah, dude, I think Heart Gold is a great game, and you guys should totally play it if you haven't. I don't know, I guess everything's been so uptight lately. I don't really know what the point of this video is, I just kind of wanted to record something fun and see if you guys like it. But dude, Heart Gold is so good, oh my god. So my team in Heart Gold is actually what you can see on the screen right now. First off, we got my Crobat, which I named Echo, and he's kind of a beast. Next up, we have my Ambipom, which is uh, it's covered by me, I'm sorry, Ambipom. Then we have the Shiny for Alligator. Then we have my Mamoswine, Hitmontop, and Giraffe Ring. Going through the Elite Four, there wasn't really much of an MVP. They all did pretty good. I'll tell you one thing, though. The best moment was when I couldn't figure out what item to put on him on top so i just gave him the berry that ends confusion i was just like oh okay whatever and then against bruno he's hit Lee. use swagger on me if you don't know swagger will raise your attack by two but it confuses you so i was i had a plus two hit on top and i was just under the impression i was just gonna sweep bruno with him on top but but no no him on top died so it, was, it sucked but i thought that was pretty funny now, speaking of playing through Hard Gold, would you guys ever want to see a Let's Play on the channel? Let's Play is something that's not too hard for me to record. Uh, it's a little hard to edit. I've never really been good with editing them, but I'd love to do a Let's Play if you guys would like to see one. I'd preferably like to do a co-op. I originally had one planned for this summer, but I'm pretty sure it's going to fall through, unfortunately. But I would definitely like to do a Let's Play for you guys if you want to see that. Probably like some sort of co-op Nuzlocke. I have a few people in mind that I could do it with, but I still want to make sure the other one's canceled before. I think overall, though, my favorite Pokemon game has got to be Leaf Green or Pokemon Y. I don't know why, I just always like those two games. I guess Leaf Green has a nostalgia factor. Plus, you know, we can all say Leaf Green was a good game. The post game was probably my favorite of any post game, just for the sheer fact that it was really like a original and you went to weird islands and it was nice. Pokemon Y was what got me back into Pokemon, so I guess that's kind of biased too. I know a lot of people don't like Kalos. I, I personally liked it though. I thought X and Y were good games. Be sure to tell me in the comments what games you guys think are the best or which ones are your favorites, either one. I wish people could understand that there is a fine line between someone's favorite and the best. Like, my favorite Pokemon game could be Pokemon Black or White, but you know, factually, those are the worst Pokemon games of all time. God damn it, I just started a f***ing ride in the comments, I can already tell. One thing that was really annoying about Heart Gold is how hard it is to get a mother f***ing Thunderstone. The original team I had planned was everything here, except I also had Jolteon and Caesar. Now, Ambipom replaced Caesar because I couldn't figure out how to trade with myself and I just couldn't be bothered. And Tyrogue replaced Jolteon. Now, as you can see, I really only have one special attacker. I mean, for Alligator has Surf, but besides that, it's all physical attacks and then Giraffe Rig. And I really wanted the Jolteon, like it would've helped a lot. But it's so f***ing hard to get a Thunderstone. You have to go to this girl on Route 38 or something and add her phone number and eventually she'll give you a Thunderstone. So I have this level 20 Eevee carrying around the whole time just waiting to finally get the call with the Thunderstone. Because I don't want to evolve it too early because then it won't learn like Thundershock. But no, she never calls, so eventually I've beaten the last gym, and I only have five team members, so I decide to pick up the Tyro, because I think that's pretty cool. And I'm like, oh, hit him on top. Yeah, he's going to be really good. Nope, hit him on top learns no good attacks, just to let you know. If you're ever going to choose hit him on top, he learns nothing good. But I still made him work with Reversal and Earthquake. That was pretty nice. But anyways, guess when she finally calls with the Thunderstone? As soon as I finally got out of my way to train everyone up to level 45. But yeah, that's when she decides to give me the Thunderstone, because, you know, you know, now I'll need a Jolteon, that I have all six of my team members all traded up. 
up. So that was pretty cool. But yeah, regardless, I had a great time playing this game, and it really got me thinking about how much I would enjoy making a Let's Play for you guys. So if you do want to see that, please comment below that you'd like to see it. Also, please like this video and click on all of the ads, because without the ad revenue, I can't feed my family. Just kidding. I don't even. I probably won't even have any ads on this video. I don't usually do that. Also, I don't have a family. Also, this is in my YouTube channel. I, st I stole it from someone. Well, this is probably a good time to end this cut commentary. I, I don't know where I went with this, but in conclusion, Heart Gold is a good game. What's your favorite game? What's the best game? It's definitely not black and white. And would you like to see me do a Let's Play? Answer whatever the f*** you want in the comments. I don't f*** you. I don't give a sh**. Nah, but I do love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. I should have a top 10 coming this weekend, so look forward to that. Of course, Poke Quiz comes every week. And uh, yeah, have a great day, guys. I love you so much, and I'll see you in the next video.